Well, I thought we came out, I thought we swung it really good. I thought we hit it really good and we had great intensity early. You know, we knew it was going to be a longer game because they're a really, really good team and they weren't going to quit. So, you know, we had to really kind of reset up and we had to You talked about the lineup of three home runs from, runs from yeah. completely different spots in the batting order. What does that kind of production mean? Well, I mean, it, it, you know, you can't really pitch around, you know, anybody on our lineup, and we know that. We also brought in some pinch hitters that I think Kayla Grease has been. I mean, she's been working so hard. I'm really happy for that kid to kind of get one out of here. She's, I think, that's her first one of the year, and, and she's. She's really missed this big shot. Right? So, um, you know, I know she's had big hits for us all year, and, and, uh, and she's a really good postseason player, so I'm happy to see her. Do. And y'all will square off against Texas A&M San Antonio tomorrow. How about a preview of that game? Well, listen, we know a lot about each other, so they know as, as much about us as we know about them. They've been playing great, and it's just, uh, you know, I'm happy for the city of San Antonio that both the local teams are played in the championship for each practice. Um, we're going to do our very best to, uh, you know, do what we do and, and try to hit a really good pitching. they got very, very good pitching. They've been throwing it really well and, and balanced defense and all that stuff. So it should be a great one. Someone thought it was Columbus, Ohio, but that man said it was. Saints defeated the University of Houston, Victoria today, 10-3. to They'll take on Texas A&M San Antonio tomorrow at 12.30 here at the Olu softball field. For the Elder Saints Network, I'm Eric Spielberg.